<laughs> a very good morning to you. This is a Power Talk. My name is Ram Maguko. As always, it is a pleasure being with you each and every Thursday. Uh, today we are coming to you live from the broadcasting house here in Nairobi, Kenya. We are also live on our website www.kbc.co.ke forward slash y254 is where you can be able to find us. Ensure that you follow this particular conversation online. We are live streaming from wherever you are from. You can be able to, to catch this show at the you, you, you know online uh, at the uh, at our website. That is at www.kbc.co.ke forward slash y254. And as always, it is a pleasure being with you each and every Thursday. Remember, I repeat of this show also airs each and every Thursday from 10 p.m. and uh, you can be able to catch up at uh, this particular program on uh, you know if I already missed it also on YouTube all right so uh, let's keep uh, kickstart this show uh, going now we are in the uh, season of festivities when at, uh, at a time when families are planning get-togethers people want to have fun people want to meet up you've not seen your uh, your family friends and relatives you know from the beginning of the years some for so many years and they are about to you know meet during this particular season how best can you maximize your season at the same time have fun with yourself and at the same time still ensure that you are safe for january remember january is also coming up school fees need to be paid rents need to be paid and so many bills loans you know it you have things that need to be paid yet we are at a season of festivities christmas new year can you go out and drink with your family and friends and at the same time save is it possible? How best can you be financially intelligent during this particular season? This is all about understanding the festivities, going through the festivities, festivities right here on Power Talk. And uh, to introduce my guest and help us in you know, having this uh, a conversation, I am with Ruth Modoni. He's a property advisor, someone who has experience in the field. You know, uh, he can, uh, uh, you know, she, 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 she has what it takes, man. <laughs> <laughs> it is nice seeing you, Ron. How are you doing? Fine, thank you. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> it's that time. Yeah, it's that time. Mm -hmm. And uh, to my extreme right, I am with Anthony Njenga, yes. a counselor, a counseling psychologist. Yes. Hello, Mr. Anthony. Asante sana. Kusalama. Mfurai kukuona mazi. Every day you look dapper, man. That's it, man. We're telling him to buy for MC. Yes, next year. It's about time. Ne not even uh, five years from now, actually. Unu hiyo ingini unafau kuwa MC ama MP. Hey. Watu wana kuchagua. Ni vai? Hey, uvai. Ah, wasumbue. Hiyo suti unatandikia na yo kwa TV, bana unakuria. Ha, 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 
I am in for January uh, for the festive season. Uh, and Jordan? Mimi, uh, what uh, what I'm planning to do mm. this festive season mm. to visit family, uh, sana sana family to spend time with them because it's been an year since I went. We shall go to Gotia, the grandparents. Mm. So I'm planning to go spend time with family. And uh, bado bado yet sija 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 anza, but I'm, pre I'm preparing myself psychologically because you know people should also learn that before stepping into the festive season now that we are in that time that period psychologically they should be, should be they should be prepared that the events that will be coming along mm. you know companies are having end of year parties you know people are yeah, having yeah. Uh, uh, family gatherings here and there so they should be psychologically prepared you know because mm. you know there are people ram uh, people who have social anxiety and who are very tricky for them too to have that in mind. But if you prepare in advance, you know that these are the type of events, or these are the events I'm gonna go to, then I, I don't think then you'll have any problem. Okay, um, th there is something that, um, uh, th there are so many areas that we need to cover. And uh, before we get into the nitty gritties, yes. generally, from the get go, because we are talking to the youth. Yes. They are, ma they are, they are the majority. Mm. Mm. Anthony, you yes. said that it's been a bit over a year since you yes, went yes, yes, to, yes. to Shabs. Yes. And uh, I know there are many youths who are in that particular position. Yes. I'm one of them. Yes. You know, it's been like a year, you know, yes. um, but there is this particular notion mm. that many are going through. Mm. They are not going home. They are not used to going home. I took computer to know Shago, they're like, ah, pana. Yeah. You know, uh, and, and for some, they see it as an outdated thing. Yeah. Yes. They don't know where their home is. Ukimwambia, I am in your money, Pekka, you know, you are always end. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's true. Always end. Yes. Ukimwambia, Shika Fair, Panda Gari, and a Baka Kwasho show, Yes. Hazi Fika, because they have no clue where it is. Yes. What would you advise you, uh, that young person? in regards to this particular notion about going to Shago, for some they see it as an outdated thing, that Maisha ni hapa Nairobi. How are you in Nairobi? Ata lugu ya mama, how are you? True. First thing, Ram, I need to know that watu wenye waendangi home, waendangi ushago, you know, there are many reasons that we can say, umtu waezi enda home. You know, kuna watu wenye wakienda nyumbani, inawakumbusha traumatic events that happened wakiwa watoto. So ndo wana avoid kuenda nyumbani because wakienda nyumbani watapatana na vitu ama na watu zenye ziliwa make of the traumatic. Maybe wakiwa wadogo wazazi walikuwa wana wachapa. They, they did not have that closure with their parents. So I'd say if to you uh, going back home brings back some traumatic traumatic events which are so so harmful to somebody psychologically then Rami says the advice to them to end home. Maybe at a foot time na mabeshte na some of the few family members when you are comfortable now are hang around now but see at the end home because when you tell a young person to go home you never know what's that you know in a remind me but if you don't have any problem with your past events, mm. then I don't see any problem of you going home because at the end of the day, family comes first. You know? but, 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 but then there is that process of uh, recovery. Yes, yes, there's a process of recovering. Uh, uh, but no, si, si kila mutu wana recover from a traumatic childhood experience. You know, uh, what, whatever pe somebody is going, let's say a young person is going through some uh, maybe relationship issues, whichever issue that we want to go through, say, may have been brought up from that childhood experience. Na iyo sasa iyo childhood experience ni natoka nyumbani. Sasa ni imagine, Izo issues zote yamekuwa saa hii time ya covid 19 saa hii time sasa tunaelekea january alafu ende nyumbani imkumbushe some of those things how will that help him unajua mm -hmm. but you, you, that person can be able to uh, seek help and asenda therapy saidiwe na counselor ku handle that traumatic event but if you don't have any absolute reason for you not to go home ram pia wewe nakuambia tafadhali enda nyumbani <laughs> salimia <laughs> salimia <laughs> grandparents <laughs> <laughs> get to know how they are doing. You <laughs> busy Nairobi, man. You are busy in Nairobi. Look for money. Not, there's nothing like being busy in life. I actually think the festive season is the time that people yes. go home. That mm. is when people go home. When the was the whole last year. time you went home? <laughs> when was the last time you went home? <laughs> We're back on the phone. <laughs> <laughs> You're being personal. <laughs> and I come personal. <laughs> um, I will be going. I will be going home this December. You told us. The last time was over a year ago. You too. <laughs> So we'll be going home this December. Uh, we'll all be going home. Yes. <laughs> you know people are looking for money. Yeah. yeah. People have gotten jobs. Yes. And also, Ram, I uh. think people are not going home. Okay, I don't, I don't know. But there's a group of people who don't want to go home because they know where when you're watu anangalia. You'll have yes. to buy the shopping. Exactly. You'll have to buy clothes. You'll have to make everyone happy. And it's not, uh, it's not in your capacity. Yes. So you tend to 
slightly move away and just stay in Nairobi. Mm -hmm. Yes. yes. Um, um, you, 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 you normally deal with, uh, you know, advising people yes. on how best to invest. Yes. Now, kuna, uh, maybe you can give me the term. Mm. If I'm investing in you, mm. uh, I am the investor, right? Yes. And you are? You're the investee. No, the you're investee. In, yes. I, I am the one who is investing in Anthony. Uh -huh. Sidio. You're, you're the investor. I'm the investor. Yes. W w what is it, uh, Anthony? The investee. The investee. Yeah, the investee. investee. Yes. Correct. Yes. So there are some investees who <laughs> shall go. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 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 the, the point to me, to even, mm. Apple. Ume anza. Ume, uh, and the question they ask, one year if you don't have the money, just stay. I think, Ram, I think, Ram, what we can say is, no joke now, what when you are in the home, when I was 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 in because at the moment, maybe you do not have money. But people don't want to understand. Yes. Mm. They don't want to understand you don't have money. For as long as you're my son, and you need to take care of me. People look at, uh, okay, let's say um, you're my son, Ram. Mm -hmm. I'm your mother, and mm. I live in Ushago. Mm. And in Ushago, mimi ndio najulikana, mimi ndio mama Ram. I mean, that's a public figure I need to keep. So Ramu kikuja kuniona, kuja na vitu, peleke ata neighbor, ni kuja nseme, ayya na Rama mefika, ale, le, 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 le. You know, there's, that, there's something that yeah, always there's, happens. There's this joy that comes. There's jo yes, there's joy that comes. But it, uh, not everyone can understand that you don't have money. Yes. But make wise decisions. But when, when, when you know you don't have money, isn't this one of the reasons why youths don't want to go home. It is. Because, because there is so much pressure to, to deliver. Yes. You're giving money, it's like you're a charity organization. Yes. And, and you don't have that particular money. So after I look at you in Nairobi, I'm busy. I think you can just stay in Nairobi. I love to me too. A small token to your mother and say, this is for this and this. And But that does not give you, that does not mean you don't go say hi. Okay. Come out here in festive season. End of January. January, mm. there's no festive season. End of Salimie. Yes. Chila zima upeleke vitu mingi. Yeah. Just carry sandu. You cannot go empty handed. At least tu makitu. So, so utaki kuenda because our watu wana, watakuka pressure na pesa. Tu, tu kana irobi, tu makitu kidogo. Yeah. Chila zima yeah. atiukai tu ibu. Ibu imagine Ram. Vinya metumiwe example. Mm. Eh? Anajua, anajua Ram ni public figure kopali alafu wajatuma kakitu. How will that even sound kwa ke? Itaka so, hey, unajua so kijiji vile na kuanga na mm. unatoka kwa, 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 kwa hii homestead. Kwa so will, will you do that every year? You know, after a long time, you, out, you would be knowing even where, how your home is. But you know, after Ata kama nyasi memea, utajua yu mene. But you need to go check on your parents. After an year, Ram. Uh. Utaku niembe after an year, utakona kakitu. Uh. After a whole year, Ram. <laughs> na corona. <laughs> The country is <laughs> very country from Bolivia. There are yeah. few restrictions in Mexico. Okay. Yeah, so after an year, maybe say how much sour, but an year later, that's 12 months later, how is it cost of savings? Because when you are the expectation, they expect from you. Mm. Eka to savings kidogo. Every month, at least when you are saving kitu kidogo, when you are in December, how to cost of kitu ya kutu mama ya kuenda at least kusu. Pena si lazima ati uende, ukai na ukai na your family or your grandparents for a whole month or two weeks. You can just go say hi, wasalimi ya kana ofsku moja ama few few hours. Then Rudy, si lazima ukai yuko. Let me give you a, 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 another example here. Yes, yes. We have this particular youth. He or she is with a family that is. Um, divorced or divided in one way or the other yes mama kuko the ma the the the, the dad kuko yes. they just have issues yes but it is at the festive season yes mom and a joe shall go kwao miuko of course mama who shall go on to na baba yes so ha, ha, what should uh, you know these youths do in order to you know go through this festive season and, and and feel as though they still belong to a particular family and how do you bring this together uh, yeah uh ram what i can say is personally i am in that kind of family and that now that question now bring it back to me now 
both of my parents uh, sorry to say this mm. are not staying together kila mtu ako kivi yake the divorced yes they okay. divorced okay. so okay. unajua sasa ni festive season said ya dad kuna get together on 31st said your mom they get together on 31st but now i'm like now which one will i go but what 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 matters here is before if you can december Yo, 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 from January to November at least ni make time niende kama let's say nimeamua December nitaenda kwa side ya dad then nijue from January to November I will make time and pia side ya mom at least ni waone na pia if it's get together and happen yearly na kila that first na najua ni both sides na sasa kama last year nilienda side ya mom this year I can go to side ya dad next year I can go to side ya mom and the other year evil you can just balance si lazima tuseme cuz now they are separated now I will go to I'll stick to one side one side you also needed in the other side so so, so you always separate you, you, you balance, balance each it. year unaenda huko yes. and, the, and uh, na make sure yes na make sure kama najua this december 31st i might be going to that side eh? mm. cuz kuna get together your 31st your time ya new year mm. so najua from january to november i will make time in the misalimi my grandparents your time January to November ni make time to mahali hapo ni wasa ndio isikae vibaya that if asni kipoenda waseme huyu atakuwa for a whole year but at least atakuwa anasema alikuja hata kama ni mara mbili mara tatu but, 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 but it doesn't bring friction when someone says that hapana naona unaenda huko sana kuliko uvenye huko hapa yeah but you know there's not if you're divorced parent there's not, nothing you can do about it because now it's a decision they made so you cannot do anything about it. what you need to do is that what you need to have your mind in, in your mind is this these are my parents na said my mom my uncles are still my uncles and the, my the said their dad my uncles and aunties are still my uncles and aunties mm. so nothing will change that so we'll just have to balance and know uh, that if you feel is kind of kama nimeenda side moja you are to only separate just mm. balance it mm-hmm. that's what i do personally and balance. that's what i'll do this study for balance. i balance yes ladies and gentlemen if you're in, you, you, in such kind of a setting what antony njanga is saying you balance find a way of you know seeing that this time yes. i will go to place x yes. and at that time I'll go to place y yes. and they st- and, and, and and you'll you'll be able to you yes. know get that yes. but yes. how then you know do, do do you do it because at the end of the day it takes a strain on, on yourself as a person mm. right yes yeah. yes you, you, you agree with that i do agree uh-huh. i think it's a mutual agreement for the parents yes. it is a mutual agreement whereby uh, he says anthony this time you come here this time you go there yes. so that both parents can feel yeah. as if they own you the same time mm-hmm, yeah because mm-hmm. their their dif- their differences does not concern you yes exactly. for as long as you're happy they are happy as well but you know there's some kids who take advantage of this time and, uh, and, and say mimi nataka mami na dadi wote wakuje hapa there's nothing you can do about that ram <laughs> yeah. kama 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 ni divorce and you know divorce is an official from the court mm. kama it's an kama ni hivyo you cannot change anything about it Atta, mm. as much as you want your parents together the same as much as i want my parents together as much as i want them to be both of them present for me but that can that's their life and that cannot affect how happy i am that's their life yes mm. we need to separate issues here all right yes that's their life what, what, whatever they're going through is, is them, is them. Mm. whatever i am going through is mine because when you put in your mind that now i uh, bring their issues to me now it will make me not live a happy life it will be stress sasa mbona waliachana so it will be every time i'll be working on trying and make things together but now nothing can change a divorce is a divorce and and once these guys have divorced now it it be sasa wamerudi tena into scratch wafanye harusi hiyo ni another process tena so you know if you're happy that's it yes yeah All right. um, uh, le, 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 let me hit from from, from your roof yes when we are at a, at a time like this for a young person and you know these are times when uh, emotions are always in the air mm. and uh, someone feels as though you know um you know what i wanted to have fun and uh, no one can do anything about it about it <laughs> <laughs> and, 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 and they go all in all in you know they want to say i'm 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 not all stress young you okay from january najia chilia <laughs> what do you think about that um i think you need first of all to understand how do you earn is it do you earn does your earning is it basic income is it uh, is it a uh, portfolio income or is it passive income Do you and do you work to earn or is it post for is it portfolio whereby you get to buy uh was it uh, was it uh, what is it called do you get to buy uh what's it called <laughs> shares and then sell that is the portfolio or is it passive yeah. so you need to understand where you are 
So when you understand where you are, you, you get to know how much and how much you'll spend. First of all, take care of your next month. It is true. It is the end of the year. You've made it to the end of the year. You need to feel good about it. Yes. But live under your means. Don't mm. overexpend. Uh, uh, don't overuse your money. And as I said, mm. uh, 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 before, before you can December, I'm if you can say a festive season, you need to have plans. Eh? You need to plan ahead and see which t which type of events, which, which type of parties, I'm a function that I go to. Don't you spend pesa yako, si ende apoku jechili na pesa yote. Na January you need to pay fees, you need to do this and that. Allow me to enjoy myself. And say, if that money cannot solve your problem, ah, eat that money. <laughs> And then I, I usually see people and I say, it's a cool and 500. Shamba Kamuli in 250. Mm -hmm. 250, it's a figure 250,000. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I hear the figure, eat that yeah, yeah, yeah. money. Yeah, eat it. But it's important for people to say, because now, eat that money, you forget, you know, it will be so difficult for you to manage January. Utanza kusema, oh, you know, I wish I had, you know, instead of saying these words of I wish I had planned earlier, just plan earlier right now and know which type of events and this is the type of money I'm going to use. Kama una joni salary yako uli receive, amu una receive the month, plan to your salary, say, meh, but don't take the whole of the money with the keshirehe when we spoil the wazazi. spoil wazazi, but not the whole of it. At the end of the day, you have your life to live. Mtu amengia kwa club and nasema, drinks on me. Kila mtu. Kila mtu. Kama ram kwa hiyo drinks on me, unalipo mshahara ya 70,000. Umesema 40,000 ni mekakando. 30,000 ni sawa ni yangu ya kujibamba. Kama hiyo 30,000 unajua ni yako ya kujibamba na 40,000 ni kakando umeka ya January. Kama ni 30,000 unajua nataka kujispend, sawa, drinks on you ni sawa. I want us to touch on another angle. Perspective in terms of priority. And this is, of course, relative mm. it is debatable but i want to find out from you guys what you think about the aspect of priority whereby these guys have called you amesema twende pale the other guys have called you twende pale now um for some guys you know they choose for some people they choose not to go to either places mm. and they are always the ones who are called uh, the introverts mm. or antisocial some tembelea watu you know enaga uh, out you know be, be someone who is uh, social and you know they are always uh, called different types of names mm. because they don't always say yes mm. to going out and they always say no to invite mm. How best can someone prioritize which places to go to and which places not to go to and at the same time maintain their own dignity? Ruth. I think that is a very nice question. So let's talk about the introverts. Yeah. Um, for as long as you're at peace, for as long as you're happy, be an introvert, sit at home, that's okay. For you come first before anyone else. So as the moment you make a decision, think about you first. Does it make you happy? If it does not, achananayo. If staying at home or even taking it out, that, was, that is what will make you happy, mm -hmm. stay there. Do that. Do that. Don't get pressured about people. What mm -hmm. to attend Sherehe? Because they're extroverts. People, like me personally, I love to see people around. Mm. When I'm stressed, I love seeing people around. You like going out? Not going out mm. necessarily, just to see people. I can even get out of the house and just watch people. Because that gives me peace. Yes. It gives me peace. Do you, do you like the view? Yeah, I like the view. I like looking at people. I'm just wondering. That person woke up in the morning, did this and that. I'll do this and that. I'll even go out to check up on my friends. And I have friends who are introverts. They don't like seeing people at all. Mm. And that is what that makes them happy. Mm. So this festive season, if you want to sit, sit at home. Do what you want. If you want to go see family, for me personally, family comes first. Mm. I'll have to go see my parents, my grandparents, uh, enjoy their company. And if now you don't want to go that side, you can go have a drink with your friends, enjoy, but keep your dignity, as you have said. Okay. Please do. Uh -huh. Anthony? Yes, what I can say is the same, same thing on the tema. If it makes you happy, then do what makes you happy. If you feel like you don't want to go out, nobody's forcing you. But, but, but then how do you balance? Because if at an hour to peer, mm. 
You know, sometimes they get angry. They get angry. They, do. they, they can get pissed. You know why they get angry? Because yeah. at the end of the day, uh, there are people, you, you know, around we have friends that we call friends, but they're not necessarily, necessarily friends. That's why, that's why there's, uh, there's this Robert Burrell Lesema, uh, keep your circle small. The, num the, the, the friends that you have, make sure and they are very few, because they are friends who even don't know your personality. They are friends mm. who don't know your personality is an introvert. Mm. Because you know there are, are different types of persona. Kuna mtu wanakonga introvert, kuna extrovert, na kuna ambivert. So if you as an introvert, you feel like going out and uh, maybe uh, isn't a thing for you, na una feel it is okay for you to just stay home, na hata kama hawa takasirika, if they are your real friends, Ram, they will understand that it's your decision and they will not force you on that. Uh -huh. But if they are not, they will be pressurizing you. But if it's a friend who understands that you, 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 you have this type of personality, then hata ku keep, hata ku, hata ku, 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 ku influence at you when they're out nine or wherever you are. If it makes you happy to stay home and relax and have your drink maybe, you can even tell them to come over. Si lazima when they're out, kama wanataka when they're out, kuwa, ama wakuone, wakuje, kukuma utaki kutoka nje. Now, I, I know, Ruth, come to come to you. Ladies like sleepovers. <laughs> <laughs> we do. <laughs> huh? We do. <laughs> a lot. Now, what do it's, you mean? It's, it's alarming, <laughs> Kwangu. I don't, I don't, and this visit is. Nani alikwambia na kujasleep. these invites have become a lot. Ladies, uh, ah, they like sleepovers. <laughs> they like sleepovers. Any, any msana hizi katu kwa nyumba tu wala. Ani na shanga, what's up with ladies and sleepovers? Um, I think sleepovers, it depends. Una sleepover wapi, is it at your boy? friend's place is that is it at your friend's place hmm. where are you going to sleep over okay uh-huh so where are you going to sleep and over? Why do they, uh, let's start with the a lady and other female friends okay uh, and I don't know what happens in these sleepovers. Maybe you can tell me. I don't know <laughs> what happens in sleepovers <laughs> during this time what to another what what I know what to how to would you advise people to go for sleepovers? Are they are, are they a go to uh, for you? Is it something that you would do? It is not something I would do. Of course, it's with you and friends. <laughs> it is with me and not friends. Not with you and a man. Ah, not with, with me and a man. Between you and, a, and, and friends. <laughs> me and friends. It's something I will do because um, friendship is really nice, and I keep my circle very small. I think mm. I even have actually five friends. Mm. I think even five is female, a lot. Female. female friends, yes. No male. Mm, not really. Hey. <laughs> man, man. And I'm very straight. <laughs> on behalf of the man, on behalf of the man. Ouch. <laughs> <laughs> okay, but you keep it straight. Yes, I am. So, if you want to go for sleepover, sleepover for, with friends, it's okay. And there are some people who go for sleepovers with their with their male friends. Yeah. Just to mark their territories. Do you enjoy festive to Kowangapi? What do you mean marking your territory? See, you know this festive, you utajua sasa mkuangapi. Ah. And you utajua mkuangapi, so unaka na unasema leo na lala. Actually, kesho ni mina pika, na angalia 24, 25, 26, na toka 30th. Itabiga mekosana na mmoja, na mindi onabaki. Na mindi onabaki. Na huwa wanaacha items. Ah, na wanaacha, eh. There's another meme rama iso. Ati toothbrush enyo unawacha. Ndiyo mwingine anakuja kutengeneza edges nazo. My God. Edges are... Edges. Now I'm this. Zanyuele. Zanyuele. Who unaacha ya kubrush? Mwingine anaingia anatumia kama ya kutengeneza edges. My God. Ramu unendanga sleepover? Mimi nenda kufanya. Mimi nenda kufanya. Akwa, wapana. Mia kuja. None of the above. No, no, no. By the way, just my own personal opinion. And this is for those who do it. And I'm not saying this is the way to go. I'm not saying this is what people should do. My own personal opinion is, although I don't encourage sleepovers, I don't encourage them mm. because I feel when I let in a kuja man a man no mingi upon on a loser by the what are we? Let me tell you, Ram. Let me tell you, Let me tell you, Ram. This year, me at a feel, let me at a me when you are. People, what are we saying? What are we? What are we? To two or two. Two or two now say me what are we? We are crossing over to the new year. But I don't know what we are. We don't know. I think it's about time uh, we know. One of the New Year's resolutions, we are not we. <laughs> <laughs> what am I? <laughs> what am 
my personal preference is that I don't think it is right. Mm. I don't know about you. I don't think it is right mm. for a man mm. to leave his house at any kulala kwa nyumba mwanamke. That is not right. I, I don't think it is it is okay. But, but, uh, if, even, even if that is your girlfriend, mm -hmm. even if that is your girlfriend, mm -hmm. watch aye ya kuje kwako. Si uwewe kwenda huko. I cannot go for sleep over. But you know Ram, uh, one thing you don't get is that uh, there, mm -hmm. there are ladies who feel comfortable with a man coming to their to their house. Lady the mwanaume kikuja, dem kuna dem ako comfortable mwanaume wake, mwanaume wake kikuja kwake kwa sababu gani ana feel ako comfortable hapo the environment. Hakuna maybe this man is maybe can try to do something atakuwa comfortable. I I don't I don't see any problem so if you See if it's a visit ni sawa. If a sleepover. But if you're comfortable, Ram, at the end of the day, when I do Ram, kuna watu different. We're all different. Yeah. Our, our decisions vary. Ona za kuna decision. I na mungina za kuna decision. If to you, you're watching me as a man, you're comfortable to go to your lady's house. Isi kuwe regular lakini. Isi kuwe leo, kesho, kesho kutua, usizoe, at least to watch a dem, akuja kuwako. Kwa nini isi kuwe regular? Kwa sababu gani? Mwanaume Ram. Ha ha Mwanaume Ram anataka kufeel eh demo kikuja kwake anataka kufeel yeye ndio unajua nikufanyie kitu nikupikie nikufanyie but sasa mimi nikienda kwa demo unajua kuna vitu siwezi fanya nikilala mgu yangu nimekelea hivi itakuwa issue but but i i feel like a man you're not supposed to go regularly regularly on a ladies kwa kwa nyumba ya demo at least go once in a while but si sana i don't think you should even go a man yeah do over sleep over no why i think Ata ego yako inashuka. <laughs> I don't know. Fimbio, I don't know, if, why? I don't know if, if I'm exuding too much ego, but uh, no, I cannot. Not, but yes, why? Why? But there are people at the end of the day, mm. if it makes a man happy and if it makes the lady happy, if you guys are in a relationship and you're both comfortable mm. with the man, the man is comfortable with going to the lady, then why not? But not on a regular. And then I mean, what I'm trying to say is, kama nyinyi wawili muko comfortable na muko sawa ni sawa but isikuwe mwanaume amezoea kuenda kwa demo hadi inafika point wewe mwanaume anaweza kuleta hadi nguo zake kwa demo it doesn't make sense mm -hmm. let it be just once in a blue moon okay. mara moja moja but if you two let's say ni, ni Ruth na Ram if you two are comfortable kama muko comfortable that is ni sawa but if one of the party is not comfortable then you can sit down and say by the way you know what i can you can come to my place na mimi mimi naweza kuja mwanaume anaweza kuja kwa demo visit just talk so it out it, it depends on how the two of you are yes me yes. think i'd love to go to the man's side and see ya kuje ndio anipikie you know soft life kidogo so sasa akikuja si mimi nitapika ah Now, you need what, to be smart. What about men who cook? Akupikie. Eh yeah, anipikie uh, kadina hivi hivi yeah. au shevyombo. Uh, si ndio, si came. You like that? Ah, I do. Rami inaonekana wewe hiyo shevyombo. Wewe ni mwangalia hapa. Eh, I love cooking by the way. By the way, my hobby is I love cooking, I love washing the house, I love washing clothes. I love that. Missy Nashida. Look at how Ruth is looking at you. Yeah, no, no, no. But it's true. Yeah, yeah. It's true. You know, you know, you know uh, one thing, mina, what, one thing society na culture zetu zimetufunza mwanaume afai kufanya this and that. Mwanaume afai kuonekana jikoni akifika. But at the end of the ram, okay. you can do that to make your, your 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 lovely wife or lady feel nice. I, I want to take a short break, but I, I love what you're saying. You like men who can cook. Mm. During this season, men yes. should go out. Mm. Cook for the for the for the women. Yes. yes. You know? Yes. Even if that is your wife. Mm. Mwambi babe, today we're not going out. Yes. I'm not cooking. Yes. I'm not cooking. Bus. I mean, it's a, it's been a whole year. Exactly, man. It feels good, Ram. <laughs> ah. <laughs> You're done. <laughs> Let that short, break, that short break will be back in a bit. It's all about understanding, uh, you know, getting through this festi festive season. The hashtag is uh, Power Talk Show at Ram Maguko at Y254 Channel. So you can be able to engage with us. Tell us what you think about this particular season. How are you going to get through your festive season? What have you planned for yourself? What are the financial decisions that and, and, and financial plans that you have made for yourself as you go through this particular festive season? Remember, we've posted a question on our Twitter handle and on our Facebook page, and we're asking, um, how best can you be financially prepared? How are you prepared? 
Keep engaging with us. The hashtag is Power Talk Show at Ram Maguko at Y254 Channel. Tell us where you're watching us from and I shall sample your feedback after this break. Let's take that break. We'll be back in a bit. This is Power Talk. Y254. Imagine. Welcome back. This is a Power Talk uh, right here on Y254 TV. My name is Ram Maguko. If at all you're just joining us, you're just in time for the uh, very next part of this particular conversation. Remember, it's all about understanding, you know, going through the, this festive season. How can you make best <clears throat> the best financial decisions? Decisions pertaining to your finances, to your relationships, to your health, to your life, to your family. It's all about understanding, going through this festive season. I'm seeing many people are watching us also on online. And you've asked our question on Facebook and Twitter. Going through the festive season, how best can you be financially stable, financially prepared? Uh, the hashtag is uh, Power Talk Show on Twitter at Ram Aguko and at Y254 channel is where you can be able to engage with us. To sample a few of your feedback, Nganga Wawanjira and Sema Gidunguri Town to Kupamoya Sana Hadi Tamati. Kalale Wayuna wa Kamkunji and Sema to Kupamoja Racha Jose and Sema Hana any idea. <laughs> I've got no idea on how I can get you, you, you can get financially prepared. All right, don't worry. Uh, we, we are here to give you an idea of what you can do, uh, Jose Usijali Sana, my brother. Keep engaging with us. The hashtag is Power Talk Show at Ramaguko at Y254 channel. Remember, it's all about understanding the Facebook season. I'm, I'm with Anthony Njenga and Ruth here, uh, uh, my fantastic guests of the day. Uh, when you're on a break, we were, we were having a tete a tete. <laughs> <laughs> Before we went on that break, we were talking yeah. about how, <coughs> you know, um, men and women can uh, relate and uh you know going for sleepovers and whatnot mm -hmm. now let me get another uh, yet a different perspective of this because during this festive season yes. allow me to say it as it is because power talk is where we we say it as it is yeah. men are going to lose their innocence mm. this season yes men are going to lose their virginity this season mm. How best can a man, you know, prevent himself <coughs> from, <laughs> for lack of, I don't know how to say it, from destroying someone's innocence? And how best can a lady protect herself from stray and, 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 and <coughs> manipulative men who wants to, to take advantage of her during this season? Because it is that this time, Nine months from from December, Utapata Jamana Nazaliwa, some Aguko Junior playing around, yeah. Ram Junior. Yes. <laughs> 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 Ram Junior. Yes. Your thoughts? Um, I, I think a man already knows what he wants with you. Mm. The moment that he sees you or even talks to you. If a man gets to talk to you in a perspective of, come, let's have dinner in my house, you will know the agenda of a man by how he talks. Yes. You will know a man by how he explains himself. Mm. So to keep your innocence this December, just listen to a person. Listen to how he says it. So it's not about that he come, let's do this and do this. If you want to go out, go out in public. You don't have to do it in private. Hmm. Do it in public. I mean, what is there to do it in uh, to do in private that can't be done in public? Yes. Nothing. Come on out. Let him take you to a restaurant. Yes. Let him take you to a restaurant. Uh, so, yes. so, so one thing that ladies should avoid is uh, having dinner dates in their men's houses. Actually, not only dinner dates, but avoid going to a man's house. House. Anthony. Exactly. So hmm. what I can say for a man, you need to know what you want in this lady. You don't have to go saying there, you know, I love you, you know, I want to spend the rest of my life with you, you know, you know, this and that, you know, but you need to know what you want with this lady. If it's sex, just tell her, you know what, me just want us to be friends with benefit and I just have it with you, one understand. And, and if it's a lady, you're comfortable hey, with that. Hard question. 
Hmm? <coughs> <laughs> yes. At you what? If you get the money, one sex from this lady, just tell this lady. You tell know her what? directly. I want friends with benefits. Just mm. go straight. Stop beating around the bush. After five months, then you come to know that uh, you, this lady, this man was after sex from you. Just be direct and say, you know what? I just want. <laughs> I'm not ready to date. I just want us to just have these friends with benefit, and then that's it. For the lady, you need uh. to preserve your dignity. You need to know that uh, it's not a must you you have it this time. You know, you can preserve your dignity, dignity, and know what you really want. Also in a relationship. You have to ask something, Ram. What are you saying? What are you saying? I'm avoiding some questions. I'm avoiding some questions. Ask it, ask it. <laughs> say it as it is. Yeah, say it as it is. Yani, there are people, okay, yes, the, yes I, I, I'm not that shocked. I'm not that shocked. <laughs> it has happened to me once, okay, <laughs> twice or thrice. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Somebody can just tell you I want friends with benefits yes. with you. Yes, yes. Is is that a bad sign? You know, is, is that a sign of a bad friend? No, that's not a sign of a bad friend. But uh -huh. you know, at the end of the day, if uh, if you want a lady, you mm. need to go straight to the point. But that's not, that doesn't mean you're a bad friend. It just means that you know what you want from this lady. Don't okay. just go say. Imagine Ram, you telling this lady you want a relationship with her. You want to spend the rest of the life with her. You want to travel to Maldives, Mauritius, Seychelles with yeah, her. And you sure, want her. yes, you, you, you just tell her you're the only thing that she. You know, you even when Arusha mister na mwambia we we ni mlango kuzi ni mekunoki. You know, something <laughs> like that. You know, <laughs> ah, you, you just oh, lie. Yeah. You just be straightforward <laughs> and say what. Ni mekunoki. You know. <laughs> Has, has anyone ever said that to a lady? Yes. I'm going to say, I'm going to fungi. I'm going to be a dem. I'm going to fungi. I'm going to come back. Kwa nini? Ndosi angu kiem tu mingine. So yeah, just be straightforward. Know what you want. Know what you want. Be straightforward. And uh, don't go beating around the bush. Don't waste this lady's life. It's not like the old dem. Now, Ruth, I want you to talk to your sisters. Because there is that lady who is who is head over heels of a man, but she doesn't know that this man is just not good for her. Yes. And she's going to lose her innocence this month. Mm. This month she's going to get pregnant. Yeah. Yeah. This month somebody is going to lose her virginity. Yeah. This month, God forbid, somebody may even lose her life because of hanging around yeah. the wrong type of friends. Yeah. Mm. Talk to your sisters. Um, don't give out. Don't give it out too easily. A man is a hunter. If he's serious with you, yes. he will hunt. He will hunt. So you have to know, you have to really look at that person and listen to how he talks. Ram, us as women, we, 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 we do our actions out of the heart. Mm. It's psychological. You can do, you guys do anything. But the time you're coming to me, me and Adani, we're, have, we're in a relationship. Mm. We are not. Personally, I think we're, we're having something. You, you know your agenda with me. So this December, this festive season, take care of yourself, keep your dignity. Let me tell you, the moment you give, you, you have sex with that man, even your Imeisha, even your Taenda, because that was his agenda. But you but gave him a leeway. Hmm. So don't give people a leeway to your heart. Not even to your heart, but to destroy you. You can't be counting at you may have sex with you, you know, how many people this December. Yes. Ati Uno Lisa, how many are you a virgin? How many people have you had sex? Unaka. One, two. You can't even count. I mean, keep your dignity. Mm. Don't don't be loose. Let people respect you. But you're in love. And that's where we go wrong it, as as ladies. It, it, it's not that you're loose. You are just in love with this man then you will be, we'll get in love with so many men in the year, if it's mm. about love. Me, let me tell you, Ram, I've never thought I'm, I was in love. Mm. Ah. Character Ram. development. Character development. <laughs> ah. Ah, Ram. Ah. Ah. Character ah. development, Ilini Gonka. And I'm, and Apple, I'm, I'm telling my friends, I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm in love. I do this and this, and my friends are just looking at me. And they're way away. Character development in Utah Gongo. Let me tell you, Ram Nili Gongo, your character development. You know, Ram, uh, one thing I usually tell uh, what? One hmm. thing I usually tell people, hmm. eh, even men and women and ladies, eh, uh, young men and well, young ladies and gentlemen, eh, I usually tell them that when you when you're in a relationship with a lady, or when you're in a relationship at the moment, or maybe you wanna be in a relationship, sex shouldn't be the, shouldn't be the main thing that you go for. Mm. Sex should be just 
it's something that happens, but it shouldn't be the main thing. Don't waste time for this lady. And if it's you, because even ladies also have intentions of sex with a man. It happens vice versa. It's not only the man who wants sex from the lady. So sex isn't the only thing that you can have with this person in a relationship. You can build more than sex. Yes, it is important, but it isn't the main thing, Ram. It is not the main thing. Yes. Guys, it's not the main thing. And even if, and, and, and my belief is, if somebody is in a rush to have sex with you, then you should really check on their priorities. Mm -hmm. Red flags. Yeah. Red flags. Eh? Red flags. Uh, and check. if he cannot wait, <laughs> then he's not worth it. He's not worth it. That's true. Otherwise, you you hit the nail with the head. You're going to dip. You're going to dip. Very true. You know, you're going to know someone named Inoki. Apple sasa. But it's true. That was a lame joke, though. But it's true. But it's true. But it's true. You cannot wait. If this person cannot wait, he's not worth it. It's not worth it. Mm. Very true. Quotes by Ramaguko. Now, I want us to um, look into this particular perspective. Those who are dating, this is the time when a man is going to develop ulcers. Because the woman, the wife or the husband or that particular partner that they are having with, wants to go to Diani and you have no money. And I said, Mami, all my friends are going out for, the, for Christmas. Last week, I nearly pele kwa as you wapi. Mimi, mimi pia nataka kwa out. The pressure that is put on relationships because of Christmas and New, new Year. How, how should we handle our partners during this time? Ruth. Um, I know there are so many relationships that us women are waiting to be taken to maybe dates, to coast, mm. um, Madeleine Diani, and maybe your partner is not financially stable. Um, I think, I think your partner should. There's a festive season coming. Mm -hmm. I'm not saying it is, is obligation to do that, but it feels good to be taken out. If you do not have the money now, um, try get some cash somewhere. I'm not saying, <laughs> or actually the best way, let that person borrow from next month. Are you saying you should take a loan? Not a loan. No, do not take a loan for enjoyment. Hmm. Just borrow from next month. No, this, this is the amount I've taken from next month to do this. So there will be a deficit next hmm. month. Hmm. You have to occupy that deficit for the hmm. next month. But if that is what that makes your girlfriend happy, take her to Diani. Are you saying ladies should... Akisema nataka kuenda pali aseme na simamia hapo hadi apelekwe out. I don't think so. If it's a serious relationship, there should be understanding. Si lazima apelekwe. But if you sit down and tell your lady, si na pesa, but in January, I will take you to Diani. It doesn't mm. have to be in the festive season. But kama ni ule wakusumbua, aye, mm. uya si wako. Uh, Anthony, there are, there are men who are going to be put under pressure here mm. to pay for things that they don't even know. That's a red flag, huh? And 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 you know, there's are some ladies who are out with their friends. Ate, ni I love you, bye. But you know, Ram, uh, all this starts from the beginning of you starting this relationship. Mm. You Ram. You are a man. You can get a relationship. You can approach them. Na expect, ama na zile high hopes, na mweka high hopes, ni kona pesa. Ni mm. takufanya this and that. Then this lady, as much as we mwenye unajua hauna kakitu, then atakuwa na mini, uko na pesa. It's the fault of the men, but the women are under, putting them under pressure. Yes. You know why I'm saying this? Ram, you can approach them. How do you do it? Just be point blank. Don't mess up. Don't beat around the bush. Tell this lady. Come on, Najua, you're not financially okay. financially okay. Communicate with this lady as early as possible. Usimweke high expectations at you know the first date to Villa Rosa Kempinski. Now, Najua, kabisa how ways you afford to Villa Rosa. 
you know your pocket very well unaweza afford kwenda a hotel in town yenye utamlipia chips so ya 150 but you giving her expectations on the first date that will take her to a high end restaurant but you cannot afford so as a man you need to know that you need to be straightforward to this lady before even getting into this relationship ndio mkiendelea isifike hizo hizo times yenyewe una anaanza kukupigia na kuitisha pesa na kabisa unajua una but wewe wenyewe ulimuonesha ulimuonesha uko na gari unaweza afford expensive restaurants so as a man be genuine with this lady and if it's a lady who does love you it's a lady who if it's, if it's a lady who likes you and wants to spend life and wants to, to spend the rest of her life with you then i'd understand if you don't have money ataku, ata, ata understand because at the end of the day relationship isn't built on just love money lazima ikuwe mahali kidogo but if if, if you're a lady unaona utalia kuna effort mali ana make then why not it's not about ati mimi nimekuja kwa relationship niko na nina ana salary ya 50k i can be earning even 10000 but i can be able to it's not about the money at the end of the day pia it's not about the money love yes cannot be sustained without money but not extreme money ati lazima nikuwe very rich na niweze ku sustain kuna let me give another example yet again You know kuna watu wamekuwa kitusumbua social media nitaoa hii mwaka nitaoa now you have i don't know how many days left but don't toa i think you know ram i think you know where i am heading to yes. you know d- during uh, february valentines mm. there is a uh, uh, people are saying valentines is coming where is your where is your boyfriend you are sitting at home only now 2021 is over and there is a, a lady or a gentleman yes. under pressure aoe mm. ama olewe mm. family na eh hey, mwaka imeisha mm. na hatuoni mtu mm. i love they ask you kuni ah uh, unafikiriaje mm. <laughs> unapanga aje <laughs> your thoughts yeah hizo masaji zinakuja na hapo <coughs> ndio umegonga yeah. where maybe maybe i am mm-hmm. um, kama hakuna hakuna na kama iwezi haiwezi mm-hmm. sasa ram tutafanya nini what will we do the men are there but where are the serious men men are there everywhere actually but there are very few serious people <laughs> nami hata sijui wako wapi wako wapi ram <laughs> My, 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 my director <laughs> I, actually I have, I have two people upstairs so uh, they're talking it by ear uh, <laughs> meniambia ati mwambie Ruth tuko hapa Ah ah mama na Timo nimetaja jina hili amesema wako hapo after live niko na wao ni hivi sisi ndio tuko anasema sisi ndio tuko but honestly um, i feel as if like people personally i'd love to settle and have a very um, peaceful life mm. see kupita hapa hapa it's tiring and mm. for my mindset and just to be happy and know what i want and, and you know the older you get the more you your priorities change yes. the, more you, the more you want something serious and something constant yes what 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 can, what then should a woman do you know because uh, you don't know how to respond to your parents mm. and relatives because i see umesema mtu aende ushago umeenda ushago now you are you are show show he's asking you huh? my grandchild mm. before i die mm. i want to see him to see someone yes and let me tell you kuna watu wameolewa in the mind you know you guys are dating and you think this is the man that i'll, I'll get married to but maybe the man is not even there Yes. But you in your head ukisikia mtu anaomba let's go meet my parents it's too early maybe I'll come yes. during that is a red flag and me I'm uh-huh. wondering where are the serious people uh-huh. honestly are you saying that if you tell your partner that it's time to see the parents and they say it's too early it's a red flag it is a red flag why would you want, not want to go there because you know you're not serious who unajua kenye unataka i'll differ Yes. Why? <laughs> yes, yes Anthony. You know I'll differ. Yeah. Look, because you know at the end of the day uh, as much as we both want to settle as much as we are dating and we are looking at the future that we want to have a family together what matters is are you psychologically prepared for marriage? Marriage is not easy road. It is not easy. Marriage is so difficult. That's why most I think 75% of our youth right now Ram are not marrying mm. because marriage is so difficult and right now you, most people most of our parents are divorcing 
So you imagine your parents are divorcing and you want to get married. How will it be? But so, Anthony, meeting the parents does, does not necessarily mean you're getting married. I know, but you might not be psychologically prepared. Because you know the parents, your parents will have expectations of you too. Utakuwa na expectations. And I expect you, you, your sukuna venue uko mahali. So those expectations, kama the man is not psychologically prepared. You communi that's why communication in a relationship is very important. You and your man sit down and agree. You know what, babe? Right now, I'm not, I think I'm not ready to meet uh, our parents right now. But definitely, I am planning and I am looking into that. Is as I say, my two apana with no reason. What I say, my apana na kona reason, valid reason, because there are men as much as you want. To get to go see the parents, the man may not. You know, in this relationship, you are both of us. It's not only about one party. It's about you two. Your happiness and uh, your vision and you two wanting to grow life together comes first. So I, sit I, down I, and talk. I, I wanted to compare in the sense where the woman wants the man to see the parents, but the man is saying, "I'm not ready." The man is saying, "I'm not ready." Yes. Psychologically, the man is not ready. Mm. He might, you, you as a lady, you might be ready because you know ladies mature more than men. You know that, Trump? Ladies mature so fast than men. Psychologically, this man might not be maturely prepared to get into marriage. But there must be, as I say, me too, how you could prepare, Trump, there must be a reason as to why I'm a sema, si ko ready ku So the lady should inquire uh, further about yes. what the reason could Communicate, be. Communicate, because at the end of the day, it's about you too, and you want to do life together. Do, do you agree with that, Ruth? One year. No, huh? I don't think so. Uh -huh. It's Let's say we've dated for <laughs> one year now, yes. and you've never met my parents. Then ne what are we never, doing? Never. Yes. Even at, at a kupitia kusema too high, see yes. a serious meeting. Yes. At a serious meeting, it, it doesn't have to be <laughs> one year, honestly. You know what I say is, uh, if, you are, if you're dating someone, at least make, make time, come and date, mama and boy, ujue at least mzazi. Hata maybe see what ajai, ajai yonge na one of your parents. Yeah. Ah, yeah. Oh, forget one year. What year? What if it's less than a year? Ay, mi ram ni takupeleka. Kama ita eza, ita eza, by the way, but huh? mi takupeleka. Kono mzazi? Yes. What is the least time when you nasema hapa, now, from here, kwenda nyuma, we are not ready. But from here, kwenda bele, lazima wende mzazi. Psychologically, uh, you need to get the mindset. Una, ufa, una faku date dem na kuwa na mindset ya kuwa between six, 6 to 18 months. Mm. Hapo ndo inyo period ya kuwa dem. If you pass 18 months, then... But if it's below six months, then at least hapo kuna venya. But if it's six months, we may date for six months to 18 months, then hapo kuna ready. Actually, even one to eight months, you only know, That is yours. It's me and you. So if you think a one month hapo, if you, and you, you want to see each other's parents, that's okay. I know. One you only too early. Ah, yeah. Now, what you've, you, you've given the example of when the woman is ready and the man is not ready. Mm. What about when the man is ready and the woman is not ready? When the man is ready? Yes. The woman is not ready. <coughs> when the is, man is ready, is the lady is saying that no? <laughs> when a lady says no, yes, Jua, are you ready? Yes. It's not that he's, she's not ready, but there's somebody else. But do balance? Man, yeah, there's a, there's Anabalance. somebody an balance and she nani nani, and then you can't introduce all of them. You have to be sure of the person you're introducing. Mm -hmm. You can't go introducing everyone to your parents. Yes, and it is during this December, this season, that people are doing introductions. Yeah, So you see things are happening. Uh. But if now the lady akisema you go prepared, Ram, dem akisema you go prepared, you go prepared. Lazim ana kuna venya na kuwe. Ana dem buko 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 <laughs> is it worth it or not? Atraki ni kupeleke rama lafu tena tumekosana the next the next 31 week. Wacha tujuane, let's put our private relationship for like 8 months. Sa kutoka hapu wacha ni kuintroduce. Okay. Because mm. at the moment you mpeleka kwa wazazi ya lafu uluwa expectations za wazazi na yeye, because ladies have a soft heart, naturally. Yes. Ladies forgive easily. Mm. Madema wako na soft heart. Mwanaume wako na rongumu. Lakini ladies can really forgive and they can, they are so easy to heartbreak. Very easy. Kitu kidogo itawauma. Mm -hmm. So if we imagine, uh, Dema mesema, no, uh, amekata, eh, alafu, wewe uko hapo, una, ki, una keep on insisting, keep on insisting. Then imefika mali, maybe Dema kakubali. Then after some time, ameku introduce, alafu kujulua expectations awazazi, as a Dema. How will that even make 
her field psychologically atakuwa anajua eh wazazi wanajua niko na wewe sasa umeanza issues tena how will that be now you get it it will be so difficult so yeah I That's think a very sad turn of events. <laughs> yeah, it is so sad, but it happens. Congrats in a half of daughters. You see, it doesn't want to work about it. Wambie, manzi. Wambie. Ata wale, bado ata nijib. Where are the serious ones? But Rama li sema na younger and <laughs> that three days yes <laughs> ram ram <laughs> eh? this is the ram <laughs> she approached approach them na namkatia in three days i want na him to tell us one day one day so ram what's the secret how do you do it honestly how do i how do you do it and do you break people's hearts what are me to nikulize i'm a heartbreaker yes i am it's good to accept yeah it is good people admire you even online that they send you texts say i like you you're handsome i like how you present i like blah 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 when can i see you can we go out yeah so um and you can't accept them all So, sure, sure. It, of course, you've broken hearts. Yeah. yeah. And how do you? Hey, to one day. Uh, 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 it uh, 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 if to ram it then it can work. It is possible. And for the one day, how long did it stay? Come or to is ram it university. <laughs> Huh? Ah, nice. <laughs> Come to Ram University. I will school you. <laughs> A place of uh, where learning is uh, <laughs> <even> <laughs> first priority. <laughs> yeah. I want us to 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 uh, take a look at what's happening on social media. Now on uh, TV this is uh, uh, all right. Rachel and Asema watching you from Uitedi. Asante sana loving the show. Uh, this is Mark and Asema uh, enjoying the program. Uh, Mark here watching you from Gidurai Massive. Thank you so much Mark. Now na hapa hivi eh Then Asema I love me the conversation fire 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 burn them. Na na hapa kuna mtu anasema tuko hapa. Ruth tuko hapa. Usituache. Tuko hapa. Thank you so much for your for, 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 for your feedback. I can't be able to read all of them, but I want us to have final comments on this. And then i shall be able to wrap this up with a quote let me get it on my phone here but before b- before that quote let's have a final comment and, f- and a final word mm. what would you say is the should be our take home that you'd like us to uh, you know uh, every person watching you today to remember as they go through this festive season because at the end of the day <laughs> whatever has a beginning has an end December started, December will end, mm-hmm. January will come. What should be our take home for the day? Let me start with you, uh, uh, Anthony. All right, uh, what I can say is, number one, you need to plan well your savings. When you know the money you are going to use this December, and when you receive in January, you will have to pay for it. And number two, uh, for the ladies, please preserve your dignity. I know this is the time where you go to events, there are parties, preserve your dignities. And for the men, please, let's not misuse these ladies of ours. They are so precious they are baby girls so don't see what to me yeah you know and uh, this festive season uh, I, i'd like to tell you just enjoy yourself visit family if you want to just enjoy yourself but don't don't say if that money cannot solve your problem if that money <laughs> it can you can eat that money but january kifika you will regret why you ate that money mm-hmm. just know how to save jua pesa kutumia this festive season you january kifika isikupate babaya just before even i say the take home <laughs> my parents are watching and my dad is telling me at the ah ah usiwaambie kama haiko haiko waambie tunaenda watamu iko 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 ah watamu nayo tutaenda but baba ruth mkienda watamu <laughs> to, to send back this other side. Yes. Lakini <laughs> <laughs> the men are there. Akina team up hapa juu. Eh, nimewatafuta. Sinaona after. <laughs> anyway, this is my take home. <laughs> you guys enjoy your festive season. Take care of yourself. Um for the ladies, not everyone loves you. Some people are coming to get what they wanted. So wengine wanaona tu a nice figure, beautiful lady and they just want sex from you. Don't just be smart please be smart and this man this man i'm sitting with apa these guys are hunters let them hunt 
if they want you seriously, they'll hunt. But if they, you give them easily, too bad for you. But enjoy your festive season. For those people who are thinking of the financial decisions, personally, mimi ni melipa rent ya January. Ukiniona ni kiparambulate, I am settled. Let's usikwe ule rafiki January utaanza utakujo useme ati. Please Ruth ni saide na 2000. If you, kama ujitengnezi, kama ujisaidi saai, tusipatane January, alafu wanza kusema misi rafiki. Ram, I'm talking to these people. Take care of your, take care of yourself. Take care of your financial decisions before, in, and before you enjoy your festive season. Pay your rent, pay whatever you need to do. Then enjoy with, with whatever you are left with. Wow, that yes. is Ruth Mudoni and Anthony Njenda. Yes. Karibu ni sana. Thank it's a pleasure. You. Thank you. I want, to, I want to end with a quote. And as always, you know how we do it. Tell us what you think about this. Do you agree or do you not? Be happy. Not because everything is good, but because you can see the good side of everything. And that's what brings us to the end of this morning's conversation right here on Y254 TV. My name is Ram Maguka. Big thanks to Anthony Njanga and Ruth Mudoni. Uh, thank you so much for coming. Uh, it was all about getting through the festive season. My name is Ram Maguko. Merry Christmas. Happy New Year. May God bless you and may God bless the work of your hands. This is Power Talk. <laughs>